Fest. The only thing defensively, boys, is obviously this is our contact day, so we just get the intensity up a little bit that reflects the, the level of the game that we got on Saturday. That's it. That's all I've got. Good to start the tournament off with a win and also gave us plenty of things that we needed to work on that, that we can go into this game uh, with and have confidence in the way that we've trained. So um, for us it's been a great week, um, really enjoyable week and uh, yeah, excited for tomorrow. France are a fantastic team, they've got some amazing individuals and obviously they're, they're a top team in the world for a reason. Um, you know, when they're when they're on form and they're playing well, they're a really tough team to beat. We just need to sort of focus on ourselves and put our performance out for 80 minutes, and um, hopefully we can do that. It's a special place to come and play when you turn up and all the fans are there supporting you, um, and when you walk out, you know, it's a, it's an incredible feeling, and to have support like that is very special. So, um, yeah, really excited for tomorrow, and hopefully we can put on a performance that everyone can be proud of. There's a lot been said about how we're going to start tomorrow, I think, from now until the game, just make sure you get a mindset right there. Yeah. 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 Catch Scotland versus France in round two of the Guinness Six Nations, the greatest international rugby tournament in the world. And there's Harry Tatterson who comes into this side late. 21 year old makes his uh, debut in that 15 shirt up. Ruth Ben White, now Finn Russell. Sione to a below two. To hand on the moment. Harry Tatterson has a ball outside. Looks inside. Brilliant, brilliant, sensational. Top pass, top draw. Diamond Stunner Rugby from Scotland. Five from five and 
Cardiff. Six from six in this season, Six Nations. And what a start to an international career from Harry Patterson. <laughs> the captain last week, he's co-captain this week with Rory Darge. He's won from two from two as captain of the Scotland side, and he's yet to miss a kick in the 2024 Guinness Six Nations. The French will be very happy to get the ball off the field and get themselves off the field at the end of that first half. There, number 10, the bath number 10 these days. Sure. Ben Russell looking to continue his 100% record in the Six Nations this year. Yeah. Slightly quicker ball. Biel, Biel, is this the chance for France? Biel, Biel. Reliable Ramos, reliable again. Causing pressure, but then maybe through the gap. It's Kyle Rowe, Kyle Rowe dancing, diving, Jenkin. Good straw goal on the channel. It makes it, it's Russell. Ben Russell reclaims. Is that Scotland's moment? No. Is this it? Nick Barry. Oh, he's almost got his nose in the turf, Nick Barry. It's a massively controversial ending to the game. It's a confusing one to be honest. Um, it is a strange one when it's your debut, and it's that's awesome. But then you know the result. I was just so confused about what happened at the end. It's real mix, isn't it? Significantly the best crowd I've ever played in front of. It was awesome. And I had to kind of keep the emotions in check during the anthem, just focus on it, but focus on the game. But uh, yeah, pretty special day. Oh!